guys, it is Arika Misha, and today I am cooking uh, the Bertoli. You guys have seen me cook these before, but I've cooked the Bertoli, Bertoli shrimp linguine. I've cooked the Bertoli chicken carbonaro, but today we are cooking the Bertoli chicken alfredo and panay. You guys see it there? Let me get it. And for you, the Bertoli. You guys know I call it the Bertoli chicken alfredo and panay all right and i have three of them because you know i like to fix enough for us to have dinner and um and have leftovers so three bags is good enough because they honestly they don't really give you that much in a bag so just so you guys know i said that in my other videos they don't really give you a lot in a bag so um i usually buy three and plus Publix has them on sale buy two get one y'all know i love Publix. All right, and what I'm doing, I'm going to make my own homemade garlic bread because I forgot to get garlic bread. So I said, you know what? That's all right. I got some hamburger buns. I can make this work, boo. I can make this work. So I got some hamburger buns. I got my pan already laid out with aluminum. You guys see that? Got some hamburger buns. I'm going to go ahead and fix the garlic bread. And the only thing I'm going to do, it's just going to be hamburger buns. I'm going to lay them down. Put butter on both sides. That's it. It's just gonna be some butter bread. And you know what? I can sprinkle some garlic salt. I do do that sometimes. Put some garlic salt on it. Uh, you know, you can do some garlic butter. Make your own homemade garlic bread. So that's what I'm gonna do. I got some hamburger buns here. So I can use these. These will work just fine. Just fine, guys. So. Let me put these other buns back in the refrigerator. Okay, so you guys see I got my buns all here. Everybody get on here and fit on this pan. And I've got my butter here. All I'm going to do is spread some butter. Okay, good. You guys can see. I'm just going to take some butter here. Got my spoon. And I'm just going to chip a piece off. And lay it on there just like that. I've already got my oven preheated to 350. Just taking little chunks of this butter off. Something quick and easy. It ain't got to be fancy. It's just going to be like some buttered toast. I am going to sprinkle some garlic salt across the top of it. So it can have, you know, a little garlic flavor to it, at least. Homemade garlic bread, guys. If you forgot your garlic bread like me when you went grocery shopping, and you got some type of bread at the house, you can make your own. All you got to do is put some butter on the bread and sprinkle some garlic. If you got some garlic season, sprinkle some garlic season. If you ain't got no garlic, I just sprinkle some garlic seasoning across the top, garlic salt. You can do that uh, all season, where it's like all the seasons all mixed up. You can use that. I use that as well. So y'all can see. And you know what? You can just take your spoon and spread it on your bread. That's all. Make sure you guys can see that. Yep. I just take the back of my spoon and I spread it across my bun. You don't want no big chunk of butter sitting like that. So I just take my spoon and I just spread it across my bread. You can do this with hot dog buns, regular white bread, whatever you got in there. Tastes just as good. Just as good, guys. Homemade garlic bread. And I love the Bertoli meals. You guys have seen me cook the different ones. I love the Bertoli meals. They are so good. Sometimes I just add a, add a little salt, a little pepper. That's all. A little salt, a little pepper to them. Sometimes I ain't got to add nothing. just depends. But I usually have to add salt and pepper. Because I usually need a little, little salt, a little flavor added to them. Just a little bit, not much. So... I got that across my bread. Got our butter all in there so it can melt. 
melt all down in our bread. This is gonna be delicious. Delicious. All right. Make sure I got everything all spread it. Oh, nice. Okay, that looks good. All right, and let me get my garlic salt so you guys can see. You know what I'm gonna do? Yeah, no, I'm gonna stick with the garlic salt. My garlic salt season. Just any old regular garlic salt, guys. And you know what? Sprinkle that across. Sprinkle that across your bread. And when that melt, all that melts, gonna have like your bread's gonna have the garlic flavor in it. Garlic salt. You ain't gotta do too much. Just a little bit. And y'all already know who gotta come. The star of the show. Yep. That's that good old faithful parsley. The star of the show. See? See the star of the show always come and show out. Make it all fancy. Look at that. I mean some simple dollar parsley from the Dollar Tree. I mean, making your meal looking. Look at that. Come on now. Parsley. I'm telling y'all better get y'all some parsley. I'm telling y'all. Look at that. Look how that par Sorry, y'all. Hold on. Just to zoom y'all in. Look how that parsley is making the bread look all fancy. Dollar Parsley from Dollar Tree. Y'all can get it from wherever y'all want to get it from. Publix, whatever grocery store y'all got. Kroger, whoever got it. However much it costs. Tell me y'all y'all better get y'all some parsley. Fancy y'all meals up. Because y'all know me. Parsley always coming. If, you know, if it's something that I can't put parsley on, I, I won't do it. Alright, so I got my oven preheated. I'm going to go ahead and get this garlic bread in the oven. And let's go ahead. I'm going to get the bertolis uh, and um, get them all ready too. So, I'll be back guys. Okay guys, we're getting ready to cook the chicken alfredo and panay. Uh, we're getting ready to cook that. You guys see I've got my pot already nice and hot. I did spray a little oil in there. I did spray a little bit of oil in there. So let's go ahead. Let's get everything done. I'm going to make sure your pan nice and hot. And let me show y'all what it looks like. Show y'all the picture in front of the bag. And then y'all can see what it really looks like. Looks so good. This looks so good. I'm telling y'all. This meal looks amazing. Look at that. I'm taking y'all in. Hold on. Y'all know I got to have y'all all in the business. All in the business. Hold on. Let me get this last bag in. Looks amazing. Let me show you guys. Look at this. Hold on. Let me get a better shot. Okay, good. That's a good shot. Look at the mushrooms. These are the mushrooms. Big pieces of broccoli. Nice, chunky pieces of broccoli. Now remember, these squares, these squares are your sauce. And they just melt down. Your penne looks great. Penne looks wonderful. You got your big chunks of chicken. Not those little wimpy pieces of chicken. Nice, big chunks of chicken. And we're just going to let this sit in here, guys. And let everything just melt. I'm going to wash my hands real quick. Let y'all watch that. Okay, it smells delicious already. Get my hands washed. Got that garlic bread waiting on the stove to get. Okay. Anyway, so you guys see I got it in there. Everything looks good. Big chunks of tomatoes, guys. Look at those. Look at those mushrooms. Look at that nice size mushroom there. Nice size mushroom, broccoli. I'm telling you, Bertoli really, they really do it for these meals. They really, and they're only $8. Like, come on now. So, all right, I'm going to go ahead, cover it up. I'm not going to add my seasonings i've got some parsley of course to start the show uh, i've got some salt some ground pepper and a little bit of seasoned salt i've got that on the side i'm not going to add that until everything melts down so let's go ahead cover this up and that's what i do see i cover it up so it can get all nice and warm in there and everything starts to melt down for you so 
I will be back guys. I'll come back when it's uh, melted down a little bit more. I'll be back. Okay guys, let me take you guys in. Everything is starting to boil its way down. Everything is already starting to combine. Melt it down. All our sauce is melted down. I'm gonna stir it a little bit more. Make sure you guys can see in that pot. Taking y'all in so y'all can see. Hold on a second. Okay. All right. See the penne. Penne looks amazing. The mushroom, the broccoli, the tomatoes. Everything looks amazing. All right. Got our garlic bread in there. Like I told you guys before in my previous Bertoli videos, I love Bertoli. You just dump it in the pot. You dump it in the pot and that's it. Let everything melt down. Put it on a medium high heat. Cover it up. Let everything melt down. I did already add my salt and pepper. I added a little bit of garlic salt. And um, that's it. That's it. They are so quick, so easy. Very flavorful. Look at all that. Look at all that goodness. Look at all that. Now that broccoli look like a mini tree, but it's good for you, y'all. Trying to put more greens in the diet. But yeah, it looks amazing. It's finished. It's finished. Once you bring it to, you know, it starts to boil a little bit. A little bubble bubbly. Look at that. Can't tell me that don't look good. The tomatoes. The broccoli. Uh amazing oh that looks so good i know i know it looks so good the panne looks all good and soft and creamy with the alfredo oh i can't get over those mushrooms and broccoli oh my goodness y'all mm -mm -mm. looks so good all right y'all that's it that's it y'all Y'all seen me do it, so you know I did it now. Don't start no foolishness. Don't start and it won't be nothing. Y'all know I did this. Y'all saw me do this. I'm not going to uh, keep arguing with y'all about that. Y'all seen me do it, so you know I did it. All right. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social... Wait, I ain't showed y'all the garlic bread. Gotta show y'all the garlic... Hold on, y'all. I was getting ready to do my spill. I was just getting ready to do it. All right. This is done. We're going to cut that off. That's all nice and hot. That's all nice and hot. Give y'all one more look at it. Y'all can't tell me that don't look good. Y'all can't tell me that. Because I'm not going to listen to y'all. I'm not going to listen to y'all. So let me go ahead and um, get this garlic bread out the oven. It should be done. So let me go ahead and bring that out, y'all, so I can show y'all that. And then I'll do my little spill. I'll be right back. Got to show y'all the homemade garlic bread. What? Hold on. I'll be back, guys. Okay, guys, this is it. This is the final reveal. This is it. Taking y'all in to see that uh, Bertoli chicken alfredo with penne. Looks amazing. Mm, 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 mm. Look at all that green stuff. Yeah, it looks yummy. Lord, help us with all that green. We need it, Lord, so help us with it. Yes, but it looks good, y'all. I'm going to give it that. It definitely looks good. We're going to eat it. Trust me, we're going to eat it. All right, let's go over here to that homemade garlic bread. Y'all see it? Bring y'all out first. Yeah, take y'all in. To that homemade garlic bread. Come on, camera. Here we go. Homemade garlic bread, y'all. All right. You seen me do it, so you know I did it. And I ain't going to keep telling y'all that. Uh, this is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, knowledge, oh yes, it's power. Better believe it. Bye!